Hey guys, Alita here. I wanted to share a little bit with you on closing the deal. What does that mean? And maybe you're a little nervous about it. Like, do you need certain language? Do we need to be salespeople? And all of those questions that come up. And I wanna start off by saying, you don't need to be a salesperson. I sure am not. I'm pretty sure I talked people out of Jane Plexus more than I ever talked them into doing it. And so I wanted to share a couple of tips with you that have worked for closing the deal. But the number one thing I wanna share with you is always sharing from your heart is the right way to do it. Always being authentic, always being yourself, and always keeping the needs of the other person at the forefront. So if you're talking with someone and they say, hey, what's Plexus? And you tell them, you send them the Triplex video maybe, or the Slim Activities video, and you're like, you know, these are our products. Um, and they come back and they're like, oh, that sounds great. And then they just don't respond for a couple of days, maybe even weeks. That's what we're gonna talk about, is closing the deal on, on those folks. So here's something I have learned from doing this for five years is that some people just aren't ready and that's okay. And some people are ready and they're just busy. We have to remember that Plexus isn't at the forefront of their thought process right now. And so a few for, like few reminders, gentle reminders is a good thing. You're not bothering them. You're giving good customer service. So a quick little reach out for an example with that would be, you know, hey friend, you had said that you were interested. I would love to help you get started. Is there something that I can do to help get that process started for you? Would you like me to do it for you? Do you want me to walk you on uh, over it on the phone with you? Um, whatever that looks like, just a gentle reminder. Another thing to do would be to check in um, with a testimony and say, hey, I know we had talked about you wanting to, um, you know, not have migraines anymore. I just saw a friend of mine post this and I thought, oh my goodness, that reminds me of you, Miranda. And so sending them a shortened version or just a screenshot of that testimony and sending that in there and just starting that conversation again. So when somebody comes to you and they're wanting to do Plexus, but they kind of just keep sitting on the fence, I want you to remember a few things. We want to give them value. If they haven't signed up yet, it's because they just haven't seen the value yet. So our job is how do we increase that value to them? How do we show them that, hey, this is worth it? This is worth your time to order. This is worth your hard earned money. This is worth your time and commitment to taking the products. And so asking questions is so helpful. You know, what are your health goals, friends? Um, you know, so when when you first have, have a conversation, it's learning, okay, yes, they do struggle with migraines. They're looking for help with that. Maybe they're looking for help with PCOS or an autoimmune issue. Um, and really being able to gear things towards what they are looking for. Because again, we're trying to fill that need for them. Another thing that we want to be looking for is any kind of like time issue. Like if you notice that they're a really busy mom and they just don't have time, we want to give them a value of this is really customizable and super simple to just throw in your purse, you know, and take on the go and you don't have to worry about all of the things to take with you um, and all of the, like, you know, you're not trying to do crazy amounts of meal replacements or anything like that. Letting them know it's customizable to them and to what their needs are. It's so, so important. So again, we're just increasing value for our friends to see why they would want to take these products. Notice we're not convincing. We're not saying, oh, you've got to do this. You'll love it. You'll love it. You'll love it. <laughs> what we're doing is saying, hey, friend, I saw this and it reminded me of you. Value, value of what their needs are and we're going to meet those needs. Okay. The next thing I wanna say is that closing the deal, so let's say, okay, they're ready to go, you get on the phone with them, which I recommend, you sign them up on the phone, they're super excited. The deal is not closed just because they've signed up. The deal keeps on going, okay? Because this is where we're different. This is where Plexus is different than buying your, your supplements at Target or Walmart and never taking them. We're going to be coaching them on their products. We're going to invite them into our community of people, of support. 
We're going to um, invite them into having some fun and to meeting some new friends. We're going to invite them into accountability. We're going to invite them in to refer other people. And so what happens is sometimes we think the deal is closed the minute they sign up. And that's just not the case. Because when we treat them like we've closed the deal, then it's kind of like, okay, you're on your own and we'll see you later. What we want to do is say, invite them in, gather them in and say, hey, you're wanted here. You're welcomed here. We want to see your health improved. How can we help you? How can we serve you best? Um, and then letting them know that they also have a referral link to share with their friends. And that's how you're going to grow your business quickly. That's how you're going to serve your customers best. That's how you're going to serve your ambassadors best and really making those valued decisions and giving them value, increasing the value of the products and of the service we offer to them is how you best close the deal. You guys are amazing. Let's go close some deals.